The anniversary is a real milestone for this neighborhood, a neighborhood that wasn't willing to give up on its future. <laughs> Flying soccer balls and happy kids seem like a dream at Goose Creek Heights. It's not something I would have thought 30 years ago would have happened. Not that long ago, a new soccer field was just a fantasy. It was sticks, bats, weapons, and it wasn't good. And they weren't playing games. But the 10-year anniversary of Summer Ridge Apartments prompts a real celebration. Tenant screenings, security cameras, and a caring staff fueling the turnaround. There is no way I would be able to do this on my own. And so it's really been a collective effort. Police, city leaders, and neighbors working together for years. Officer Scott Fuller leading the charge, taking the neighborhood from fielding the most police calls to nearly the fewest. The biggest reward, I guess, for, for me is be able to support the people, men, women, and children that actually live out here. A once dangerous park, marred by drug deals and violent crimes, now houses a Head Start program and community center. It was built here by volunteers, all free with donations. Yeah, go! As kids get in their kicks, the new soccer field represents a remarkable transformation, plus a commitment to keep it that way. We have a lot of new homes being built here. Our property values are, are up. Goose Creek Heights came a long way over a decade. Now it's poised to succeed for many more. In Davenport, John David, WQAD News 8.